Hello friends, today we are learning what is Web 2.0. So let's start. Web 2.0 describe the current state of the internet which has the more users generated content and usability of the end users compared to its earlier incarnation web 1.0 is general web 2.0 refers to the first 22nd century internet application that have transformed the digital era in the upper north of the dot com bubble key takeaways Number one, Web 2.0 describes the current state of the internet, which has more user-generated content and usability of the end users compared to its earlier incarnation. Web 2, Web, Web 1.0. Number two, Web 2.0 does not refer to any specific technical upgrade to the internet. It refers to a shift in how the internet is used. Number three, in the new age of internet, there is a higher level of information sharing and interconnection among participants. Understanding Web 2.0 Web 2.0 does not refer to any specific technical appearance to the internet, it simply refers to a shift in how the internet is used in the 22nd century, 21st century. In the new age, there is a higher level of information creating the interconnectedness among participants. This is a new version allows users to actively participate in the experience rather than just acting as passive views to take the information. Web 1.0 was that 2.0. Web 1.0 is used to describe the first stage of the internet at this point. There were few content creators. Most of those who are using the internet were consumers. Static pages were more common than dynamic HTML, which incorporates attractive and animated websites. Coding or language content in the stage came from a server file system rather than a database management system. Users were able to sign online guestbook and HTML forms are sent via email. The term Web 2.0 came into use in 1999 as the internet reported toward the system that actively engaged the users here were encouraged to provide content rather than just viewing it. People were new, now able to publish articles and comments and it became possible create user accounts on the different sites therefore increasing participants web 2.0 also gave rise to web app self-publishing platforms like wordpress as well as social media sites sample of 2.0 sites include wikipedia facebook twitter and various blogs which all have transformed the way the same information is shared and delivered